So here we are at Fire and Ice and uh, Anatomy of a Mountain and I've changed this whole switching mechanism around so that it works again. Uh, the switching me mechanism used to be this whole elaborate booster that would go around in a circle and would kick you on down the road. The, uh, the problem we want to solve here is just that you're coming in this way and most of the times you just want to continue on down down this road to uh, P-Min Square but occasionally you'll want to go off and uh, optionally go down into here, Anatomy of a Mountain. The uh, the trick here is that, well, what you want to do is have something that just delays you for a minute, gives the gives you the option of going somewhere else, um, otherwise you'll just continue on your way. So you can kind of just go and not think about it, or you can wait for the switch, push the button, and continue on. So the way this thing works now is, uh, I'm, I'm rather proud of it, I have to admit. It's uh, it's if you land here, you can push this button, and we'll go through each of these in a second, and um, you'll see the switch happens, and the uh, also the the uh, powered rail lights up at that point. The um, the other thing that happens is as you run over this switch, we uh, let's let's open these up. It goes down here and sets off this delay circuit and this delay carries on and uh, basically goes and finally sets off this torch right here and if that torch sets off then that gets you merrily moving along the rail again um, finally you can if you land here and you really know you just want to continue on down the road you just push this button so there it is let's try it out So here I'm just going to sit, and by sitting, it eventually kicks me on, and I continue on down the road. And so option number two is uh, I could have done the same thing. I could have gotten to that spot and just immediately pushed the button here, and that would have continued me on down the road. I won't show you that one. That's kind of boring. Um, and let's see if I can avoid this pig. All right. And finally, if you push the button here, you'll continue on down into Anatomy of a Mountain. So anyway, that's about it. I'm just uh, happy that I could get it all working at once, that there's basically three ways that, uh, that I could enter, you know, that I could continue on. I could just wait, or I could um, push the button and continue on to Wumpus immediately. What's nice is that it's hooked up so that by pushing Wumpus immediately, um, it also immediately uh, sets off the, the launcher. And uh, finally, so there's no timing. It used to be a kind of a timed thing. So here we are in anatom anatomy. Um, or I could just push the button and carry on. So that's about it. thought you'd enjoy it. But wait, there's more. I thought I'd show this control room to uh, explain a little bit about this other switch that I made with some pistons, which I think is a pretty cool little switch. So let's try it out to just show you what it does. So you basically pick a button and pulls the piston away and that helps you shoot off. So what did we just do there? Well, the idea of this piston is just that you have this uh, powered rail that's constantly on and you pull a piston away one way or the other and then that lets the, uh, the other piston, as it were, push you, push you down that powered rail. So Let's just take a look at it. The mechanism's this, that this rail ends here, and then you push a button, it pulls the piston away, and then pushes it back. All that delay circuitry is there just because, unfortunately, it's just really the placement of the buttons. I really wanted the buttons to be here and the pistons to be here. So you could have the piston actually be here and pull away, but uh, I liked this design because it kind of let you open things out a little ways that way. Anyway, the delay circuit is because you'll notice I push the button, it pulls the piston away, and the button comes out at the same time. Normally this button, if you push it, it's actually kind of pushing this piston back into place. So anyway, that's why the delay circuit's there. Um, the other cool thing to note here, or the other interesting little problem to solve was if you fall this distance, so here you're falling onto that track that's below us, um, if you fall that distance, if you just fell onto the rail, you didn't go at all. Uh, you would fall into a powered rail, but it wouldn't move you. Um, so I had to have that little tilt there, that little slant, uh, that little slope, to uh, to make sure you continued to go forward. 
So anyway, that's about it. I just thought it was kind of a clever system. And uh, let's drop onto that rail. And that's about all. Um, so here we're just ending out at the end of the uh, anatomy ride at uh, Heaven's Teardrop. And that seems a fitting end. Uh, hope you enjoyed the whole ride. It's uh, It's been fun making all these circuits. They're, they're great little puzzles.